We really got started in the summer of 2009 and we opened December of 2010. Uh, there was a lot of work to be done in identifying the market opportunity, uh, creating our story, uh, developing our point of view, and then executing against that. The big idea really is redefining luxury, so it was very important to us to be cemented in the premium luxury tier. We needed to perform at that level to be able to deliver the financial returns on the investment. And so uh, I think luxury has changed. You know, Las Vegas was for many years about somebody created an idea maybe back in the day of the Mirage. And for 21 years, everybody tried to take that idea and just make it slightly better and make it slightly better and make it slightly better. We tried to re redefine it. We tried to be the beginning of the next era. And luxury is about experiences and about ideas. So spirited and vibrant, design-driven, accessible, a place where you want to hang out. And, um, and, and the big idea was create trips to Las Vegas that would not have otherwise happened. Defectors, people who have been and checked it off their list, or people who just said, there's nothing there for me. Um, there was a real opportunity for us to look back and see what had resonated in Las Vegas, uh, maybe in, in, in that place in people's mind that they held this romantic notion of what Vegas was, kind of bring that back in a modern and relevant way. And, and that's where I think Profit really helped us kind of hone in on some of those ideas. And, and there are lots of examples of how we've been able to do that at the Cosmopolitan. And we've had an immensely successful launch. Success is measured by the by a number of things. So it's it's my team and their belief that they can innovate. They can play the godfather out of the pool, and that's okay. And we can, um, you know, do a Strokes concert in a ballroom, and it's one of the best concert experiences you'll ever have. To having Kid Robot in P3 Studio to you know, a New Year's Eve party with Jay-Z and Coldplay. It's, there are metrics we have, probably my team more than most marketers, have a lot of metrics built around our business. So um, we've, we're at 4.5 billion impressions since probably November. Our awareness is in the high 50s. We've outpaced Aria, Mandarin, any brand that's been introduced to this market in the last two years. Consideration, we outpace all of our competitive set. Our Q1 earnings were just released. We have the highest ADR and occupancy and market in the luxury tier. So that's, uh, that's amazing. The, the, the interest and the demand and the buzz that we've been able to create around the experience makes us all very proud. doesn't mean it's not a, a daily slog and there are parts of the business that aren't where they need to be, but at least everybody has the same vision. We all share you know, one vision and that, a lot of that came from John and the work that Profit did.